long did you know these young ladies before you had sex with them? So the first one I had met in April in October of 2016, I believe. And <laughs> I think we end up like actually being attached to each other to each other enough to do it the next month. <laughs> But the relationship lasted till February. Oh God. But the relationship lasted till February. Oh wow, that's that's wonderful. And where did you meet this young lady? Uh, in school. Uh huh. She was a senior that year. Was she a virgin? No. Who who um who initiated it? Her. She asked me to come over, and then I didn't know what to do, so she just kind of took control. <laughs> so she was she took your flower. Yes, she took my money. Did she? Yeah, she took my money. Does your mother know? Yeah, she found out about it. How did she find out? I was, <laughs> I was on the phone with my cousin telling him about it. And she overheard the conversation. Well, I guess it's... Well, she didn't even tell me until like three weeks later that she found out about it. She just brought it up out of nowhere. And she was like, hey, so, uh, so you went, so you lost your virginity? And I was like, what? No, what are you talking about? She was like, don't even lie. I heard that phone conversation you had with your friend uh, uh, a couple weeks ago. I'm like, what? I'm like, you was listening that hard? <laughs> I mean, you was literally listening that hard. <clears throat> and then, what about you, Miss Jay? Did you wait till marriage? Yes, sir. You know my history, Connor. Don't ask it again. Then, uh, so I don't even want to know about yours because... It was embarrassing. And then, uh, <laughs> and then the second girl, uh, I knew her. Um, I knew her. I met her back April fifth on her birthday, and we ended up hooking up like two weeks later. <laughs> but we've been talking to each other for about ever since then. So. So you don't intend on being serious with any of these. Oh, no. uh, well, he's, he's still I talking to that girl. Yeah, well, we, we, well, I've still been messing with her ever since April. And um, By well, messing? Um, what do you mean by messing? Like, <laughs> we're not like tied down, committed, but we only Your talk to like friends? each other. Are you like, are you exclusive? Yes, pretty much. But we're just, we just don't have titles. Don't have what? Titles. Like girlfriend Like and Mr. Boyfriend. and Mrs.? No, girlfriend and boyfriend. That's a title? Yeah. A title. Yes. Like Sir DeAndre Lemons. It's like she doesn't call me her boyfriend, I'll call her my girlfriend. So it's a but female we're, friend and but a it's, male we're exclusive friend. Exclusive to each other. How do you know that? We've talked about it before. You believe her? Partially, yeah. Girls are trouble. Yeah, I know. <sighs> so right. you rather relax to be able to talk about your sex life. That's amazing. Yeah, he's sure. real. He's not open. Sure. Hopefully, you'll find a girl tight down. It's like everything has some real love. Hopefully, too. you don't have any illegitimate children. That's my concern. You're right about that. <laughs> because what would you do? What would you do if this girl came to you next Wednesday and said, "I'm pregnant"? Shoot, sure, I'm just have to get ready to take care of my kid. <laughs> you do what? I just have to get ready to take care of my kid. And how would you do that? Mm, I have to get away somehow. He's got a job at White Castle. Gotta, you got you to you gotta step up when it's time to step up. That's true. That's a that's a good manly thing to say. However, no, no matter whether um, and everything happens for a reason. So, if, oh my if, God! <laughs> but you have to build those reasons. You can't just jump into the lake and hope you don't drown. Exactly. You don't want to bring babies into this world. Mm -hmm. I know what you're talking about. But. You're 18 years old. You want to be saddled with a kid? Mm -mm. Not the pl not the plan at all. What does your mother say about this? She. I mean, has she ever talked to you like like I'm yelling at you? Yeah. He asked her to come over when she ain't home. Yeah, she's cool with it. She doesn't specifically know what we're doing. She just she's not that. stupid either. Yeah, she's not stupid. By any means. Just don't bring any she's babies just like, in. She just says, as long as I don't, as I'm using protection, I don't bring any babies in. She there you go. Okay. Long story short, I guess that's what it boils down to. Mm -hmm. Don't be bringing no illegitimate babies into this world. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, wait. What does an illegitimate baby mean? Not planned. Oh, okay. 
illegitimate means you're not married and the baby is a bastard and it has to take her name instead of the male's name to not being married. <laughs> uh, regardless, if I was Illegitimate have, if means I'm, you are not a legitimate... I love, <coughs> I love that word choice, though. Bastard. Well, they are. That's what they used to call them. If yeah, you, you're right. If, if the male or female are not married and... and is that, also baby, where the, is that also where the term uh, son of a bitch came from? I don't know. I feel like son of a bitch Could came be. from... I feel yeah. like son of a bitch came from a deadbeat dad. Well, yeah. Or, or, or... My sons could be the son of a bitch. I could be the bitch. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Bitch is, you, bitch is a female dog, right? Mm -hmm. So if you're the son of a bitch, then someone's calling your mother a bitch. Well, I guess as long as you use protection. And then we don't have to fight at that point. <laughs> what if, if, so if, if this girlfriend of yours pops up pregnant and you're sure it's her, yours, would you consider marrying her? For sure. For, For sure, sure, sure? For sure. What if she said no? Not a lot you could do about that, I guess. I'd be hurt, but at the same time, we got a baby, so I just have to do what I do to take care of my baby. What happens when she starts running around with another guy? I was though? just going to say, by any chance, would you ever feel the need for a DNA test? I would definitely try to figure that out, just to make sure. You would, you would require a DNA test from Yeah, just to girl. make sure. Good idea. I mean, I'm not calling her a liar hey, or sure. any other. But it's like you never name. know, so you have to make sure. <clears throat> Before you get saddled mm -hmm. with support for the next like, what if I'm years? taking care of a baby that's not even mine? <laughs> exactly. Babies are innocent. And you find they out on the 18th ask, birthday. Exactly. Exactly. Like, they didn't ask to be here, so it's why is it if young people are going to engage in that? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's enough for your. Um, um, sexual education class this evening. <laughs> the last I heard, we were talking about getting something to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I think it might have ruined her appetite. <laughs> <laughs>